welcome to another video. Today we're going to be kitting up a diamond painting from Oraloa. I did get this for a sneak peek, so I'm not showing you the picture because it's not going to be out yet until February 17. And right now it's January 21. And for whatever reason, I have it in my mind that I'm going to finish this sucker before <laughs> before the sneak peek video. I don't know. It's a big one. It's yeah, it's a it's a big one. Look at how many drills this thing has. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this is what I do. I commit myself to do things, and then sometimes I I'm successful. Sometimes I'm not. So it's a full. I'm gonna put the picture in after this video, um, because I'm not supposed to show it. But it's a full drill with fifty colors. There is one, two. Three ABs? Huh. That's kind of weird. I don't know. Um, see, this 445 is over here, and then this 3078 and 5200 are, are there, and then I'm wondering why it's not in the in order DMC wise. I wonder if they meant to put an AB for 445, 3078, and 5200 and decided not to do it. I don't know. So. One, two, three, three ABs. And I'm kidding this up on January 21, 2023. And there is a DMC code. And then normally I would have the picture here and then the information about the diamond painting, but I did cut out that part over here. So I'm going to use this here. This is um, commonly, commonly referred to as the Elizabeth Ward um, storage here. I got this off of AliExpress uh, from, did I get from Huacan? I know I think I got it from AZQSD because it was cheaper there. I, I, I just get wherever it's cheaper. Um, I do have another set on the side here in case I need the bigger sizes, which I should open this up in case I need like the bigger sizes, but most of the time, most of the time I don't need the bigger sizes, right? Um, so the drills I think are in order and I'm actually pretty bad <laughs> at figuring out what size of these things I need. So yeah, there might be a couple times where I'm just like, oh no, it, it doesn't fit. I think this only needs the small one. And I'm not going to go put the sticker in until I know um, it's going to fit in that container. That's the one hazards about this container is you have too many choices on size. So you're like, eh, it's, it's going to fit. See, I was right. It fit in this small one here. Oh wait, now the question is, is the label going to fit? So the label is a little bit on the big side, but it does fit. I don't know if you can see it. it just It's just right there. I guess I could always just put the one over here and then, so then the, but I don't know. I like it that way. It fits. Wait, I should move you this way so you can see. See the actions happening over there. Um, I'm just going to put the bag in the flap. So the drills don't have like DMC on them. So I'm just going to make sure it matches the color here on the symbol there and hope for the best. Two. It's actually been about the last time I kitted something up was in December. I, I was looking it up, December 29. Cause you know, I write down when I kit things up. So the last time I saw I just kitted something up was December 29 in 2022. So now it's January 21, 2023. And I'm like, yeah, I think this is why I was, maybe I committed myself to diamond painting this just because I wanted to kit something up. And I was like, hey, look, I got that diamond painting for a sneak peek. I totally want to finish it. So let's get it up. Now, I don't know if I'll finish it. It's huge. It's, it's, I don't, I don't know if you've noticed, I don't do the big diamond paintings that often. This is what I would consider a big diamond painting. Some people might not consider it a big diamond painting, but I consider it a big diamond painting. 
So I don't know if I'll be able to finish it. But I'm going to try. You know, I just realized I didn't tell you. I said there was three ABs and these are actually round drills. I have a tendency for these um, premium diamond painting companies to pick the square drills. Um, but I told myself, you know, I should do more rounds. Every time I finish a round, I'm, I always see how sparkly it is because rounds are, I think, just a little bit more twinkly in their sparkliness. And when you're finished with them, you're like, wow, look at how much spark, more sparkly, 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 more sparkle. I'm, I'm making up words now. More sparkly rounds are. Um, and then I wonder like, why don't I do more? <laughs> this one seems like a lot. I think I need, I think I need the big one. The bigger one. Yeah, I'm right. That would not have fit in the smaller container. So yeah, this container, if you haven't seen it before, has um, multiple sizes. You could actually get this container, I think, but it's the only these small ones from Joann's. I've seen it and Joann's. Um, but yeah, I got mine from AliExpress. But it has like four different sizes. This size here, which is the smallest one. This size, which is about twice that amount. And then this size, which looks like it's the size of the second size and the smallest size. And then there's this ginormous one, which is actually my least favorite one. Because um, <laughs> it's like so big that if you only needed one drill and you tried to pop your pen in there, it's actually pretty too deep. So I don't really like this one, but I'll use it if I have something with a lot. I think that could fit the small one. Are these these are already nicely in order one two three four five six I might have to move this a over here because the a is down there and then this o to o but otherwise oh and then this t is out yeah so the, the numbers are a little out but I think it's I wonder if it's because they were the ABs and I think they were I was thinking they wanted to do four four five and fifty two hundred and 3078 as an AB and then thought it was overkill, which it can, it, um, there, there is a chance where too much AB can be overkill. Cause I think I've done it before where I've, I've put in too many, or I've gotten a diamond painting that had too many, but you know, we all have different preferences, right? Someone might think it's not enough, and someone might think it's too much. I just have to remember I don't have as many ABs in my rounds as my squares. But I, I could use maybe some crystal rhinestones in this one. This one has water, water in the picture, so... Maybe I could use crystal rhinestones in the water. I was just trying to pour it all to the bottom of the bag just so that I could see how much it is to figure out what size I need to get mine. So far the drills seem to have be in order. So Because a lot of times when they're in the baggies, they can get out of order, which makes sense because, you know, there's nothing that is keeping them in order other than how nicely it's packed in there. I think I could still fit it actually in a small one. Yeah. 
here. Oops, I have one left. I don't actually use this storage that much. It's usually overkill for most of the size diamond paintings I do. So I do kind of end up end up using it mostly for the bigger diamond paintings. So But actually, it's actually too small sometimes for some of the bigger diamond paintings. Like I did a panel that was about this, like I did a three panel that was, I think, slight, like it was, I think they were all 40 by 55s. And three 40 by 55s was slightly too big for this container. This one's a really vibrant green. I think I've been, I'm, I don't know. I might do more big ones this year. Um, I don't know. I always say I'm gonna do more big ones and then I do and I don't, I don't know. Oh, this one is a lot. Let's see, do I just, do I, maybe I probably don't, I don't need the big, I don't need this size though. some really nice colors. Okay. Oh, I don't think it's actually gonna fit. I need the next size up. Yeah, that's not gonna fit. See, this is why I don't put the sticker on until afterwards. Because I've been finding stickers, especially the removable stickers. Now I have no idea if these are going to be removable. I haven't kitted down a an Oraloa yet. I don't know if these are going to be, the labels are going to be removable. I'm just hoping they'll be removable. 16. Okay, that's a lot. Do I, do I need this size? Seventeen is a lot also. I don't know. Might need this, the, the big one. lovely oranges. Nope, this is not a fall diamond painting. <laughs> I went from like having to use all the small ones, now I'm, it seems like I'm using this slightly bigger one. like the sequential DMC 740 741 I guess it's missing 742 oh but 742 is an AB here so hey that actually works that the 742 would fit in there um, in alphabeticalness so yeah my guess is when they were kit um, when they were charting this these ones were this one that's here and this one these two 
were that's why they're at the end were supposed to be a b's and they decided not to make them a b's and then i'm pondering if this 3766 was like a last minute a b edition and that's why it's that order on this thing so i'm doing weird <laughs> doing weird like analyzing why am i analyzing it i don't know because i work in science <laughs> i like to analyze things for fun But yeah, that's my guess, is it got originally charted with the DMCs, and then they were- Oh, look, this one's a lot. I don't even know if it's gonna fit in there. I think I might need this. It's like, really full. This must be the sky. Or the water. I have water and sky. But I'm going to put everything in alphabetical order at the end, so. Okay, this is probably going to need this second size here. Sky and water, so. And I'm guessing you think from the green, there might be some greenery. needs the small one. I do like diamond painting the ones with um, vibrant colors. I don't know. I just find the colors more entertaining to diamond paint. be wrong and I need the second size up but I don't think it's that much yeah I'm gonna need the second size up yeah I don't think I'm gonna be able to close that seem like that much <laughs> up you know it's snowing outside right now it it hasn't but it doesn't look like it's going to stick I well be that much it was raining this morning and, and now I'm like looking at it and I'm like wow it's snowing it's snowing but yeah like I said I don't think it's gonna stick it's actually been relatively warm the last couple like maybe the last two weeks because it was pretty cold the end of December so it warmed up a lot there's a lot of this one I probably need this and then and then now I see I look outside and I'm like oh look it's snowing because I was contemplating I was like you know it hasn't been that cold I, maybe I could do my spray sealing in the garage and then I go look at the temperature I was like no I don't think I could still do the spray, spray sealing in the garage it's gonna be cold this weekend I didn't realize it was going to be cold enough to snow. So, it's snowing. I thought it was just going to rain this weekend. But it won't be pretty picture-taking snow. It's the kind of wet snow. Let's see, this one's 29. I wonder if it's cheaper to kit it up this way where all it has is like the one through, you know, one through 50 without the sticker that says, you know, what DMC it is. Because I've seen several have the 
the drills in the baggies like that. And yes, you can just diamond paint from the bags. You could put the bags, uh, put the labels directly onto the bags. I just don't, I prefer to diamond paint from containers. But I know plenty of people diamond paint from the baggies and that's why they like them because they're like, ooh, I don't have to kit up. But to me, kitting up is one of the most enjoyable parts of diamond painting. So kitting up was never an issue for me doing a diamond painting. Never. So if anything, it's a highlight of me done doing a diamond painting. I mean, I haven't kitted up anything in the last like three weeks and and I just decided to kit this one up because I was like, hey, I got it as a sneak peek. I have enough time, maybe, maybe to finish it before I have to post it. I was like, motivation to do it. Like I see, I see people, um, other YouTube channels do like goals for the year diamond painting wise and I'm like nope I don't I don't do this I don't make goals I just diamond paint what I want to diamond paint at the time I might kit up and I kit up things with that I want to kit up at the time and sometimes <laughs> after kitting up they don't get done for like a year but that's okay <laughs> so no no goals I don't try to like be strive to do better next year or anything I just just diamond paint if it catches my fancy, I'll diamond paint it. No, this is not what it was. If it's new, I have a more likelihoodness of diamond painting it if it's a new if it's new in my stash. I, I should do more of my diamond paint from my stash kind of thing, but I don't. Maybe I'm one of those ones that likes just to do the shiny new thing. It's not bad. <laughs> I think I need the next, this one. But yeah, nope, I, I don't, I have no goals. This is a hobby for me. There is no, <laughs> I don't want to put goals on myself and then not make it enjoyable anymore. Or some people like to do the goals. So it helps, it helps them keep going. Me? Nope. I'll diamond paint it because I want to. And I like, I actually enjoy the diamond painting process. So sometimes when something is not turning out, I just keep going. And I'm like, well, I'm almost done. I should just keep going. Although now I, I kind of have several whips that I'm working on now. Um, I started, I don't know. I think I used to, ooh, wait, is this I used to actually only diamond paint. I might have a lot kitted up at the same time, but most of the time my whips, unless I had given up on it for months, my whips are only like three. Like maybe I'm working on a big one, maybe I'm working on a medium one, and then and then I'm working on the ones that are my one dayers, my one or two dayers, which is a lot of the stuff I unbox from the budget companies are my one or two day. Um, projects but so then I usually have a big one and then maybe a medium one that I'm working on the side oh, look at how that but right now I was like well you know they have like one that I'm almost done with but for whatever reason I haven't <laughs> oh that's for whatever reason whatever that adhesive on this sticker is There's one that I'm almost done with. I did just finish like a, it's a little bit more than a 40 by 50 picture. I did just finish it this week. So this is my next full drill diamond painting I'm doing. Um, I should finish, I should finish the one that I, for whatever reason, I, it's just been kind of hanging out. Like I only need like one more diamond painting session for it and I'll be done, but I haven't done it. Maybe that's what I'll do in my whip and chat. Which you, if, if I do a whip and chat this week, well, it'll have been in a past week for you. Because um, I, I still ponder. I'm like, I don't have enough things to talk about. Like, nothing happened. <laughs> nothing happened for me to talk about in my whip and chat. So I'm like, okay. 
And that's why I don't tend to do them every week. Just because I'm like, am I gonna say I went to work? <laughs> I diamond painted. I went to the grocery store. So yeah, no nothing really happened this week. So I'm pondering, I'm pondering the whipping chat if I'm gonna do one. But like I said, I'm recording this video is probably not gonna be up the same week I'm gonna record if I do record that whipping chat. 39, it's an AB here. Uh, this is probably not gonna fit. I need the slightly bigger one. So yeah, no mask. Ooh, wait, maybe, maybe I should do a video on putting my stuff in my portfolio book because I have a couple that I still haven't cut out. I noticed it when I was doing my 2022 finish, my full drill canvas finish video that I had not cut out and put away in my portfolio book my my last couple diamond paintings. Um. Maybe that could be Wednesday's video. See, I haven't made it yet, so I don't know. And this is a this is a video that's gonna be after that Wednesday video that I'm still pondering what to make. <laughs> Although you know, now that I think about it, the one diamond painting that I'm almost done with, where I just have like one more section, it's mostly a color blocking section. Maybe I could do a video on color blocking, not not like multi placing. Um, how I multi-place. Hmm. I mean, not that how I multi-place is the way to do it, but it's just how I do it. Maybe I could do that with that video and then just finish it. Oh, actually, I don't know. It might be too big of a section to finish on the video for multi-placing. But I kind of feel like I could do the video where I show you how to do it, but then if I just kind of just keep doing it in the video, you'll see it like repetitive and it might kick in more. Or I just make long videos. I do a helpful video and then it just ends up going on longer. <laughs> Because that's how I roll, apparently. Yeah, I didn't put that label in the nicest, but I don't like moving the label. Because I don't know how restickable it's going to be, so... My one... one... one-shot label. This is that's a really really pretty color. Okay. Uh, uh, I think I need a slightly bigger one. Okay. It's much easier when the drills are in order. <laughs> That one, that one's a lot. Do I, do I need this or can I get away with this? Okay. You can also buy these containers alone and without the outer container on AliExpress. But to me, it's usually not as cost-effective. And I've also seen where you could get this set with all of like this size only. That's uh, that probably only needs this. Okay, 
47. So I think I'm going to have not going to have run out of space on this container. Sometimes, like I said, I've gotten the bigger diamond paintings where sometimes they don't fit. I think it's because this one only has 50 colors. 48. Thinking they were thinking of making this a AB2 and then <laughs> it was probably too much. And 50, I okay, we need this bigger one. see a drill in number 30. There. Okay, so now this for labels because there's some extra labels on it and I'll label what this is after the video so I'm gonna put this in order I know I saw here's a move that okay, it's a one two three four five six seven eight a c f g h this one's an o and there's a t and this is an e actually i kind of like putting the letters even the small letters with the big letters. It helps me a little bit. Okay. These are all symbols. I like to put the sideways H next to, ooh, here's an A, the lowercase a. case the sideways H I like putting in with the H also and then this one is like an upside down U I'll still put it in with the regular U and then this is the sideways L I like putting it next to the L um, it's that's why my that's how my brain works uh, and then this is the upside down T so I'm gonna put this with the T Okay, 
nothing else is letters. Okay. So elemental P P R. So move this. R. Is there no S? Okay, so T and then the upside down T. Upside down U V X. Oh wait. L M N O. But the O won't fit, so that will just have to be. Okay. And then that's all the letters. And then let's see. What? So arrows go with arrows. Triangle things go with triangles. Here's some arrows. Things with arrows. And then and then things with lines. Yes. And then everything that's just weird. They'll probably end up being in a different order by the time I diamond paint it. There you go. But yeah, it I, I do tend to end up like at while I'm diamond painting it, decide that a different order is better for me. So um and I like to put the empties at the top because then they're farther, farther for me to, because they're farther. That's what I like. But yeah, I think in the end I'll end up, it'll end up being in whatever order makes more sense while I'm diamond painting. But yeah, that is all I have for today. So look out for hopefully the finish of this before February 17. Um, it'll probably be like February 15 or 14 depending on when the video gets scheduled but yeah that is all i have for today so thank you very much for watching and happy diamond painting bye